Let's create the presented tunnel effect based on the use of a regular texture. In the fragment shader, load our texture, define a UV vector to normalize the coordinate system to the center of the screen, and get the pixel color from the texture according to the values of the UV vector. Next, based on the values of the UV vector, we will calculate for the transition from the Cartesian coordinate system to the polar coordinate system. And as a result, we get a texture display in the form of a tunnel. If we use the time variable and add it to the value of the ST vector, we get the effect of moving through the tunnel in its rotation. But to remove strong ripples in the center of the tunnel, it is enough to multiply the resulting color by the value of the polar radius R. And thus the classic tunnel effect is done.